Welcome to the Terraria 1.3 finale for expert mode that is I'm still gonna be doing another couple of Terraria series after this but I have a planned here a pretty big boss battle and we may live we might not live I don't know but my plan is to grab the lunatic cultist and then head over to the ocean so I can summon in the golem fishron and then the rest of them but as soon as nighttime starts we'll summon in this naughty naughty present we're not summoning the night present we're summoning the uh, frost moon but uh, we'll grab the cultist and hopefully he'll follow us over there because I have a portal set up right now but uh, oh, let's see here is it nighttime yet I think seven is nighttime I'm ready for this I think we might get our asses beat to be completely honest but we also might have a chance we'll see I don't know why I don't have two of them summon naughty present time to no, not yet. What time is it night? What time is night time? What is that noise? What? <laughs> Stop. Holy shit. I'm gonna have to deal with that for like forever. Is it night time? It's not night time. 7 30. Hey boys, how you doing? Oh. Hey, how you doing? Uh, don't mind if I. Oh, come on, get out of the way. All right, there you go. It's time to head through the portal. All right. Oh, there you go. We're through the portal now. Let's summon in. Uh, let's get fish on going. Fish on. Fish on, activate. Uh, you go. We gotta, we gotta heal. You go. You go. Where's the? Oh god! All right, no. Let's just, let's just start causing some man. This is already fucking chaotic. Oh god! I don't have a dash. This ain't good. Oh my god! There's already someone like flying. Hey, golem, activate. All right. I think we're doing good now. I don't know where the cultist went. I don't think the cultist followed me to be honest. But uh, no problem. We still got like mostly all of them. And uh, we're doing pretty hot. Hold up. We almost forgot. Almost forgot the main man right here. Alright. Back onto the floor where it's nice and uh oh, might as well grab some buffs really quick. How you guys doing? You guys ain't uh that tough, if I'm being completely honest. I'm barely losing health. Do I have a dash? I don't have a dash. I don't have a dash because I already used it like my armor, my the solar flare. What is it called? Solar flare armor? Oh there you go, now I have a dash. Oh and it's gone, I used it. So the armor it gives you like a passive dash, which is really cool. And uh, once you use the dash, it uh, it like ticks off a shield, and that slowly regenerates. And every time it ticks off the shield, the shield does damage. It like explodes when it hits an enemy, or when you get hit by an enemy. So that's uh, that's really cool. I like the solar armor a lot. Probably one of the best armors in the game. Is there still someone alive after this? How are you alive? Man, that was that was some easy work. Where the fuck is this dude at? This guy didn't even follow me. What a jerk. All right, when's if I save an exit? You think if I save an exit, he'll respawn back in? I don't think it'll matter either way, if I'm being completely honest. But do we kill all of them? Oh, I didn't pick up Fishron's stuff, so let's go pick up Fishron's items. All right. Uh, why am I taking a portal? Why am I not? Why am I walking back? Where's my portal again? Fuck, what? Alright. Yeah, I was right. I was right. It was left click. Now, where did we kill Fishron? Did we even kill Fishron? I feel like... What? Did we kill Fishron? <laughs> I have no clue if we killed Fishron. Because I, I don't see his uh, loot bag down here. Is this guy crazy? Look at the DPS. Oh my god. 4k? That's incredible. Alright. Get out of here. I don't know where Fishron's stuff is. I know we killed him for a fact. Right? I have no clue. <laughs> Unless it's in my inventory, I'm just going completely blind. No, I don't see it. I would notice a light blue color in my inventory. Uh, he might have despawned somehow. I don't know. It's possible. It is possible for him to despawn, but... I don't really know how he was able to despawn so quick. Oh, I took off the water candle. But let's just let's open all this. Maybe we'll get some uh, 
some dev develop dev gear. You guys know what dev stands for. But I'm not seeing any dev gear yet. This is all garbage. I don't want this garbage. This is all trash. This is all trash. What the fuck? You guys want some of this ray gun? Dang, I still do damage with a ray gun. Okay. So let's uh that's that's really it. We did the like multiple boss fight. And there's probably a way for me to set it up to fight against like Plantera and uh, the bee and the wall of flesh. It, was, it would have been really hard because I really wanted to include the cultist in the fight. But it was really hard to do because he just straight up despawned after I left. And uh, maybe I should have just slowly f flew over here by accidentally summoning the destroyer. So I said, so I said, uh, fuck it, I'll just teleport. And uh, I guess, I guess the lunatic cultist said, nah, I'm out of here. Which is good, it's a good thing for him because he would have got like insta killed. And uh, you know, I feel for him. You know what? He didn't want none of this. Hey, how you doing? I'm just gonna stand here. See, see if I can just stand here and beat the average stream. He's still doing a lot of DPS to me. Dang! This stream ain't no joke. So yeah, that's gonna end off this 1.3 expert mode melee playthrough. Uh, expert mode was pretty hard, I'm not gonna lie. There was times where I was like, holy hell, how do I beat this boss? And then there's just times like this where it's like, no, that was really easy. Not, not, not that, it was really easy. Finally, after fighting the Moon Lord a billion times, I can insta-kill like everything, including him. Cause this, this ain't, this is like, you insta-kill his eye. Maybe not insta-kill his eye, but you will destroy his eye in seconds with this sword. Um, all of his eyes, even his, even his core doesn't even stand a chance. But yeah. In the next uh, playthrough, I'll be continuing my Summoner playthrough, uh, which should be fun because Summoner class is really cool. It's still not, the Summoner class is still not, I don't feel like, fully done. Because I feel like it's like not really an immersive class, it's more of just, I'm going to sit back and let all my minions do the work. And we'll also be doing that fishing playthrough, which that's going to be interesting to do. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next playthrough. Bye bye. Our journey has finally ended. We've came a long way, but it was all worth it. Now it's time for us to move on to another new adventure. At the end of this video, there will be two boxes you can click on. One will lead you to my summoner playthrough, and the other will lead to my ranger playthrough. Thanks for joining me on this series. See you guys next time.